Hi guys, Alicia Kliegel with Empower Your Body. So, what is the difference between soluble and insoluble fiber? It's actually quite simple. Soluble fiber goes through your body and cleans out your arteries of bad cholesterol. Insoluble fiber goes through your body and keeps you regular and keeps your digestive system cleaned out. So, there's it's a good idea to have a food that has both. You want soluble and insoluble fiber. What are some options? Oatmeal has both, as well as an apple. An apple a day really does keep the doctor away. So that is the difference between the two. Get both, not just one or the other. Your Aspire Higher today is about commitment. I always get so excited at this point because <laughs> I really believe in what I'm saying. <laughs> commitment. You need to be committed to whatever project you have at hand. You need to be committed to whatever goals you have created for yourself. You need to be committed to be the type of person that you'd like to be. You need to be committed to your values. You need to be committed to your principles. Without commitment, you don't have uh, momentum towards achieving your goals. So. When you become committed to something, it's almost like that commitment is more powerful than something that may try to derail you. I just saw something in my head and was trying to verbalize it. So the commitment helps to give you the momentum, helps to give you the foundation, helps to give you the, the push and the support behind you to get through those rough times and to get through those times where you may feel like you are becoming derailed and the commitment is stronger than the power to derail you and it keeps you on track so decide to be committed <laughs> decide to be committed i'm just laughing i said that to my client once and he was laughing at me but anyway be committed commit yourself to your goal commit yourself to your plan commit yourself to you with that, you can't go wrong. So that is my Aspire Hire for you today. Let me know, what do you think? Email me. Do you want me to speak about anything specific? Have you gone through anything in your life that has helped to empower you or to help you inspire you? Contact me, Alicia at Empowerybody. I have to say, everyone has been emailing me a lot more. At least I get two or three emails a day now. Just on my for my email questions. So I'm so grateful. Let me know. I will reach out to you. Thank you. Without you, I am nothing. My goal is to empower you and educate you. So until next week, please don't ever forget to be well, eat well, drink plenty of water, and don't ever forget to empower your body.